and I'm Nathan Johnson. Welcome to Vance Middle School. These will be the best years of your life. High standards and expectations are maintained for all in order to engage, challenge, and inspire. Our school is located at A15 Edgemont Avenue, just .2 miles north of Tennessee High School and .3 miles south of the Bristol, Tennessee City Schools School Board Office. If you need to contact the school by phone, our number is 423-652-9449. You can check our school's website for more information. The address is at the bottom of the screen. We will also be contacting parents about student requirements over the summer before coming to Vance. These include vaccinations and laptop deployment procedures. Students are allowed to bring personal devices to school, but they must be turned off and stored in lockers. You can find more information about these requirements on the school website. Once again, that is at the bottom of the screen. Arrival procedures. The building opens at 7 a.m., closes at 2.45 p.m. each school day. With safety in mind and to avoid congestion, car riders cannot be dropped off in the front of the school on Edgemont Avenue or at the gym entrance where buses are unloading. Those who are dropping off students by car should approach the school on Oakland Avenue from the direction turning onto Tremont Avenue, paying close attention to the instructions of the traffic safety officer. Our CDC students are dropped off at Columbia Road where a staff member is waiting and enter through the cafeteria. These students will be dismissed at 145 and load the buses behind the cafeteria. For safety reasons, band students are not to be let off in the front of the band room to cross the street. They will need to travel down to the crossing guard here or take the Oakland Tremont route and exit from the right of the car here. If you are coming from Weaver Pike onto Tremont, students must exit only at the traffic guard here. Students should not be arbitrarily crossing the road. All students must go to one of the two designated locations from 7 to 720. Those students are planning to eat breakfast will travel to the sidewalk to the exterior entrance of the cafeteria, here. cafeteria inside the school building. Those who do not wish to eat breakfast will enter the gym through either the bus entrance or the car rider entrance. Then sit in the designated section for their grade. After 7.30 a.m., all students are to enter through the front doors here and check into the front office. When the first bell rings, 8th grade students are to use the center staircase. At the end of the school day or traveling to related arts, 8th graders are expected to use that same staircase. When the first bell rings, 7th grade students are to use the Pathfinder hallway to get to classes. <music> Schedule. The first bell is at 7.20 and students will go to their lockers and proceed to their first period at that time. The tardy bell rings at 7.30. And first period lasts from 7.30 until 8.40. This is our 7th grade daily schedule. And this is our 8th grade daily schedule.
The dress code here at Vance is a little bit different than the dress code you are probably used to at the elementary school. For girls, you may not wear spaghetti straps or tank tops. All sleeveless tops must be at least three fingers wide. All tops must cover the collar bib. Shorts and dresses can be no shorter than a dollar bill width from the top of your knee. For guys, you may not wear tank tops or cutoff shirts, and any messages written on clothes must be school appropriate. And if you are wishing to wear yoga pants or leggings, your shirt must be long enough to cover your bathing suit area. Hats and hoods are not permitted in the building during this regular school day. Pants with holes are not permitted. You will receive a full and detailed description of dress code before the first day of school. Academics. All 7th grade students will be placed on an academic team. These teams are Pathfinders, the Navigators, and the Visionaries. The Pathfinders are the first team students will encounter when leaving the gym. This is the first boss in room. He's science for the Pathfinders. This is Price in the room. He's social studies for the Pathfinders. Language Arts Intervention. The Language Arts Pathfinder teacher. This is Ms. Carr's room for Language Arts Intervention. Um, math for the Pathfinders. The team that surrounds the middle staircase and the front of office is the Navigator team. This is Ms. Austin class, math for Navigators. This is Ms. Abel's classroom, who's language arts for the Visionaries. And here we have Mrs. Hutton, who's social studies for the Navigators. Language arts for the navigators. This is Miss Captain Amanda, the nurse. This is Mr. Wexler, science for the navigators. This is the office. The team closest to the cafeteria is the visionary team. This is Miss Smith, math intervention. And this is Miss Emily, math intervention too. This is Ms. Porter's room, Math Vision. This is Coach Leonard's class, Social Studies Visionaries. Related Arts. In seventh grade, you will rotate through most of the related arts classes. In the 8th grade hallway, at the top of the center flight of stairs, is where you will find the library. Miss Winstead is our librarian. She will help you check out a book, teach you about digital citizenship, or instruct you in our way to the 7th grade accelerated learning lab. Across from Ms. Winstead's library is Ms. Tally's STEM lab. This is a class where you will create a robot, use a 3D printer, or design a website using code. Just a little further down the hall is the Chinese class. 
This is where you will go to learn about the Chinese language and Chinese culture. Returning to the 7th grade hallway and heading towards our cafeteria will bring you to the band room. Miss Lawrence, our band instructor, will teach you the broad variety of musical styles and skills that you will carry all the way through high school. If you continue on to the cafeteria, you will find the chorus room. Miss Woods is our chorus teacher. If you love singing or performing, that is the class for you. Once again, returning to the main stairs in the 7th grade hallway, we will continue on to our last four related arts classes. If you travel down the hallway onto the way to the gym, you will find the art with Coach Austin. Coach Austin teaches students drawing, painting, and watercoloring, among many other things. find our PE classes with Coach Taylor and Coach Cantor. This is a class designed to maximize your physical activity and teach you healthy practices that will last you for an entire life. You will be required to dress out and your gym clothes must be dress code. Located under the bleachers are our last two related arts classes. If you go to the right side of the gym, you will find Ms. Edwards' digital art classroom. Ms. Edwards teaches us technology, and Tradition Arts Interactive to create modern works of art. If you go to the left side of the gym, you will find Ms. Bezos' classroom. She teaches digital music to 7th graders. In her classroom, you will learn how to use programs like Audacity and create amplifiers. If you enjoy being in front of the camera like us, the Ms. Bay's class is the one you would want to be involved with. This class often requires an after-school extension. Sports. We have many chances here at Vance for you to find the athletic program that you would enjoy the most. Remember, before you can participate in any of our athletic teams, you must have a health data and physical form on file for the office. Our fall sports and coaches are... Football with Coach Austin, Volleyball with Coach Barney. Cross Country with Coach Leonard. Cheer with Coach Barnes. And Girls Soccer with Coach Brown. Our winter sports and coaches include Boys Basketball with Coach Manhan. Girls Basketball with Coach Box and Coach Taylor. Wrestling with Coach Smith. And Swim Team. And finally, our spring sports and coaches are Baseball with Coach Taylor. Softball with Coach Warner. Boys Soccer with Coach Barnes. Track with Coach Manahan and Coach Brown. Tennis with Coach Martino. And the golf team. If you are interested in any of these sports and would like more information, please visit our school website or to speak directly to the athletic department head, Coach Tim Smith. Clubs. We have a ton of organizations to get involved with here at Vance. Some of them occur during the school day, and some of them are held here after school. The Because We Care Club meets during both 7th and 8th grade lunches during alternating days. This club is a great way to get involved into making our school a more positive environment. String Band meets after school on Tuesdays until 4 p.m. If you play a string instrument or would like to learn, find Ms. Schlau for more information. The Fellowship of Christian Athletes meets before school at 7 a.m. on Wednesdays. This club is open to everyone, and you do not have to be an athlete to join. She missed Price for more details. First Priority also meets before school in Coach Christian's room at 7 a.m. on Thursdays. This is a Christian organization that is open to all students. Please see Coach Christian for more information. The Creative Writing Club is a brand new club here at Advanced Middle School. In this club, you will explore writing and learning techniques that will make you a better writer. If you are interested in participating, please see Ms. Oakley for more details. The book club is a club that spends each month reading a book and then at the end of the month goes to watch the movie version of the book in theaters. This club is sponsored by Miss Winston. 
The Save the Planet Club is an organization that seeks out the service opportunities in our area and strives to make a better community a better place. At the end of each school year, Save the Planet always goes on a group trip to a major city with service-oriented project in mind and a little free time to have fun. This club is sponsored by Miss Liebers and Miss Stone, the school guidance counselors. The Girls Hiking Group is another new organization here at Vance. This group takes students in our local nature landmarks and familiarizes students with good hiking practices. You may see Miss Sword, Miss Chapman, or Miss Leonard for more information on this group. TSA is an after school extension of our STEM program. This organization competes in national competitions with robotics, game video game making, website design, and so much more. Please see Miss Tally for more information on this group. Chance Racing is a program that allows students to work on machines and paint schemes of a race car. These students get to go to the racetrack and watch their car race. Coach Boggs is sponsor of this club. Outside of our clubs and organizations, we have many other competitions that go on events. Right. Every year we have a spelling bee, a speech contest, and a geography bee. We also have an annual Reading Olympics competition against Virginia Middle School. With everything that goes on here at Vance, we are certain that you will be able to find something to get involved in. Tribes. We here have just started our Tri program at Vance. This is a team-oriented program that encourages positive school climbing. In this program, all of our students and staff are spun into one of eight groups that they will stay in the entirety of their time here at Vance. Students can earn points for their tribe by performing random acts of kindness, excelling at classroom challenges, bringing donation items in, or bringing their grades up from one nine weeks to the next. The eight tribes that we have here at Vance are as follows in alphabetical order. Our yellow tribe is Ace of Ada. This is the tribe of full optimists. Our green tribe is Bray Moore, the tribe of generosity. Our gray tribe is Iza Thimzi. Those who are dignified. Our brown tribe is moderated. The tribe is by Our orange tribe is nephew. This is a tribe of people who are spontaneous. Our black tribe is Takata. This is a tribe of strength. Our red tribe is Yego, a tribe dignified by intensity. Our purple tribe is Zhangyi. This is a tribe representative of justice. On your first day of school, you will spin the wheel and be placed in a tribe. I'm on Zhangyi. So I hope you'll be placed on my team. Well, if you want to be on a winning tribe, you better keep your fingers crossed that you will spend on my tribe, Yego. <sighs> Dismissal. School is dismissed at 2.30 every afternoon. All bus riders go to the gym. First load students will go directly to buses outside of the gym lobby. The second load students will sit at the bottom section of bleachers over the boys' locker room. And the third load of students sit at the top of the bleachers above the boys' locker room. When your bus comes, a teacher will dismiss you in orderly fashion by rows. Car riders will also come to the gym and will exit through either the doors next to Miss Bay's room or next to Miss Edwards' room. All car riders must wait outside on the sidewalk. No one should be in this school building after 2.45 unless they're involved in a sport or after-school program supervised by a teacher. We students are to report to the cafeteria at the 2.30 bell. And again, welcome to Vance Middle School. And the beginning of your years as a Viking.